nicely lit in here. It'd be a shame if I set off a flashbang right now. No. You made it. Well done. I'm glad I was wrong. But it was a foolish chance to take. Don't worry about the noise. We're safe here. I have looked after the well-lit room for many, many years now. There is no shadow in the well-lit room. Our is fail-safe. No shadows. Seems unlikely. Regularly, based on their make and model. Right. There's an old army base at Raincoat Point, north of here. It was active during the Second World War. They operated here back then. They must have built this. Yes, they did. It's my place now. Open the door, Alan. Oh, is this the well lit room? Are we doing it? Oh, well lit is this room. Take it, and I won't need to worry about the room anymore. Because 6 and 33 and 118 need changing soon, and I don't want to climb up the ladder to change them because it's very late, and I'm tired. There's so many shadows in this fucking it, room. This room is made of shadows. The page was autobiographical, a memory from my childhood. But I didn't write this. It was a page written by Thomas Zane. None of them were supposed to exist anymore. Alan, seven years old, would fight sleep to the bitter end. When he did sleep, he soon woke up, screaming the night was Alan fresh Wake is mind. the story. One evening, his mother, sitting by his bed, offered him an old light switch. She called it the clicker, and flicking the switch would turn on a magical light that would drive the beast away. To imbue the talisman with all possible power, she added that it had been given to her by Alan's father. Alan never knew him, and anything of his took on mythical proportions in his mind. With the clicker firmly in his hand, Alan finally slept like a baby. Now, almost 30 years later, Alan, sleep? Alan thought of this as he stood on the rim of Cauldron Lake, the clicker in his hand. He took a deep breath and jumped. My mind swirled. I'd given the clicker to Alice, yet it was here. Zane had written it into existence in a story I had written. Whoa, storyception. I can get to her now. I can finish this. Are you the one now? Oh, move your leg, jeez. Uh, I need a fucking copyright strike for this. Previously on Alan Wake, I wrote a horse. New York City two years ago. Oh. Look, it's Alan Wake. Oh. was about to explode and the light hurt my eyes. I needed my sunglasses and painkillers to dull the pain. In one of my finer moments of self-deception, I swore to quit drinking. A writer that doesn't drink. Am I actually putting on these sunglasses right now? Ugh. The sunglasses Ugh. made the world look bearable. Now I could keep my eyes open without feeling like a vampire in the sun. I wasn't sure I'd make it out there without some painkillers. Guess I better take these painkillers. Alan Shave. The pills worked fast. The prospect of being awake started to seem bearable again. There was a message waiting for me on the machine. You have one new message. Ow! Are you still asleep? Wakey, wakey! You should have your show on your TiVo. If Alice wasn't too mad to record it, that she called me earlier and really chewed me out. Yeah, yeah, we went a little overboard last night. But parties are a part of this business. Al, look, I'm saying this is your friend. She's not doing your career any favors by trying to run your life like that, okay? 
I'll talk to you later, Al. Watch the show. God damn it, Barry. Oh, I have to turn on the TV. What? Oh, that was a nice hey, show. Honey. <laughs> Did you watch the show? What the fuck, dude? I didn't say anything stupid if that's what you want to know. Jeez. Okay. okay. You want an aspirin or something? Wow. Are you going to start with me about drinking now? You know what? Go back to sleep, Alan. What? Now you can't even talk to me? Well, this morning I was angry because you said you'd be home at midnight and you showed up at 7 a.m. and passed out in mid-sentence. Damn it, Alan. Now I'm over it. Are you angry? This goddamn tour. It's gotten out of hand. Oh, honey. It's almost over, right? We can get back to normal. Then you can start writing again. I'm sorry, honey. Alan, you're not thinking straight. Just take a shower and go back to bed, huh? Yeah. You're right, honey. I'm sorry. That's weird. Once this is over, let's go away together. A vacation. Just you and me. Some peace and quiet. And then we went to Silent Hill. And I lost my daughter, Cheryl. Somehow, the clicker was the key to the cabin. I had to return to Cauldron Lake to save Alice. I'm going back to the lake to finish this. I'm going to write an ending to the story in the manuscript on my own terms to make it all right. Why can't you just write it here? Good the question. The page is still in the typewriter. I need to read it first. Ooh. Everything needs to be just right. Zane tried to cut some corners, and it didn't end well. Fucking Zane. Okay, ready when you are. I'm sorry, Sarah, but I need to do this alone. Barry? What? Take her gun. Okay. Miss Apparently, Weaver, close we're the door when I leave. just... Pointing a gun at her now. Take her gun! I don't trust her! Good luck, Al. See you later. But why, though? When I got out, it was warm and sunny. I'd flick the switch of the clicker. Had it done this? I didn't stop to question it. I had to take advantage of the sunlight to get to the lake. On Zane's page, I had stood on the rim of Cauldron Lake, about to use the clicker. That's where I was headed. Oh, now I gotta take a five hour hike to the lake? This game really is just Alan Hikes. Daylight. The beauty of the Pacific Northwest landscape. Surrounded by beauty. Alone. In daylight. Surrounded by the beauty of the Pacific Northwest landscape. It was hard not to let doubt creep in one last time. I could still chalk everything up to a dream. A delusion. I had enough imagination to make up something like this. Having been in the cabin all this time. Trapped in a story inside my head gone mad from grief over Alice's death like Hartman had claimed, there would be no way of knowing. I told myself it didn't really matter. My course was set. Fuck. Okay. Where's Cauldron Lake? Is there a shortcut? I mean, it's daytime. How bad could it be? Oh, shit. Just a nice, relaxing drive. Everything's great. Turn right to arrive at your destination. What? Okay. Damn. I was looking for hidden items. Alone. Oh, you're gonna In put daylight, me all the way back here? Surrounded by the beauty of the Alan, you're a nerd. Northwest landscape. It was hard not to let doubt creep in one last time. I could still chalk everything up to a dream. A delusion. Is this a dream? I had enough imagination to make up something like this. Having been in the cabin all this time, trapped in a story inside my head, 
gone mad from grief over Alice's death like Hartman had claimed, there would be no way of knowing. I told myself it didn't really matter. My course was set. But why did we take the police officer's gun? And why did I abandon Barry? Barry should be here. This is Barry's story. Barry, wake. Got stuff? I don't see anything. Think I'm in that trailer? Probably not. Oopsie. Oopsie doodle. We're fine. Everything's fine. Okay. Hold on. Dead. No, no. Everything's fine. Got free shit. I see arrows. You got free stuff for me? Cause I like stuff. Got a hunting rifle. And we have a bulldozer made out of light. Wow. Oh. And I um Oh! Can I have this? This seems like it would be a fairly powerful weapon in my fight against darkness. Alan, if you can learn to control this. Alright, alright, fine, fine, fine. I don't get the super OP. Oh, why is all this farm equipment? Farm equipment. Why is all this construction equipment shining? I think Alan is starting to hallucinate a little more than usual. Wasn't there a truck here? I think Alan is hallucinating light. I was really hoping that this would be drivable. Okay, cool. Oh, that's... That doesn't look safe. Let's not go that way. What the fuck? Okay. Don't press that button. Jeez. Goddamn coffee that doesn't do anything. Fine. Fine. Why is this truck so fucked up? I barely even scratched it. That looks like death. No. Okay. Super peaceful, relaxing driving section is over. And I get in this van. Nope. I see birds. I choose to believe that all happened because I scared the bird. Oh, it's nighttime wife. suddenly. Hit the clicker, you nerd! I will kill your wife. You're a nerd. Let's have a good flashlight. Oh man, I'm just getting later. Alan, turn on the sun. Is that an option? Pick up the page. Get in the car. Oh. And I drive. Yay. Why is that made of light? I don't know if that's an artistic decision or a bug. It seems like a bug. A 
fuck you in particular. There's probably something in here. I'm here to rob the place. Give me all your stuff. Uh, I'll keep the hunting rifle. You got so stuff. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Flashbangs? Ooh, okay, damn. Oh, this is the, this uh... This obviously been the room where yeah. Agent Nightingale had stayed when he hadn't been busy harassing you. You mean trying to murder you? And he was right to do so. What's behind door number C? Nothing. What's behind door letter 7? Nothing. What's behind door... Nope. Hippity hoppity. I live over here now. Nice car. I see free stuff. But first, oh ho ho. Give me bullets. Yay. Easy. There are dudes. Stop trying to break my car. All right. Ooh, there's. All right, I have ooh, five flashbangs. Damn. Got dudes. Uh, am I fighting? Barrels out. Ow. Ow. Jesus from Christ. Okay. Well, that didn't go well. What? You see that dude with like horns? Alan Dodge. Alan, you suck. I don't know if that's a dude or just like a part. Okay, I think it's like a part. Ow. Kind of unclear. I'm dead. Okay. Island took that like a champ.
Goddamn objects. Poltergeist. Oh, come on. Alan, Alan Dodge. Okay. Oh, that was a very definitive answer to that question. Flashbangs work very well. Oh, more driving? Geez, a lot of driving. position on account of my curiosity they're just throwing axes at me and I just done ran into that on my own hello I see a car does it like me are you my friend whoa it has like auto aim Jeez. okay Yeah, I think my car's pretty close to toast here. But if I could get in this nice, bright, shiny garage. Uh, I should probably get out before this dude smacks into me. Am I safe? Or is this just like a new car? I guess it's just a new car. Let's look for free shit. Was that guy just like running into the barn? There's one flare. One flare. One flare. All of this for one flare. First of all, how dare you? Anyway. Guess I'll get my shiny new car. No. Yes, I'll get him a shiny new car. Uh, didn't do a great job here. Okay. And we are going the right direction. Shouldn't have, shouldn't have done that. F, F, F. Okay, let's just get in the car and get the fuck out. That was definitely a trap. This spawn the second you like touch the door. Okay, I can eat hay bells. Good to know. That is a big fire. Wasn't that neat? Nope. Turn, Alan. Alan may or may not be the greatest driver. I'm sure nothing will happen on this very long bridge. Uh, high school boss, my friend. that stuff. Pick up the stuff. Uh, what do I have? Hunting rifle? Or is this a shotgun? This is a hunting rifle. I'll keep the hunting rifle. How oh, can I not? Uh, you know, I'm probably just getting that car. Although there's something on the ground over there. Oop. Fuck you. Boo.
It was one flare. Get in the car. Oh. Guess I can't drive that car. Get in the car. Okay. I guess we're it's we're done driving. Got some more goo. Don't touch the goo. Oh no. I'm being attacked. Oh shit. What up? Alright, probably pistol time. You got more dudes? Mm, just a few dudes. Oh, sup? Why didn't that hurt you? Right, right by the explosion. Oh, this is super bad. Okay. Wow, this is a ton of dudes. Flirt. Flirt. I'm pretty low on ammo. No, oh, that was a rifle shot. Not my finest moment. Ow! Really? Through the fucking car? Hopefully this isn't one of those situations where I'm, like, wasting my ammo on, like, infinitely respawnable dudes. Well, that was tough. Alright, so I got some flashbangs and flares. And it's driving time! Again. It's always driving time. Think that tree just saved my life. Okay. I saw a yellow arrow. Alright. There's the, uh, I guess, power plant symbol. I got some flashbang, flare gun, flare. Oh, there's a lot in there. Loading guns. Alright. So, six flashbangs. Oh, should probably pop them. Oh, huh! No. Oh, ho, ho. It's gonna spawn dudes, because there's explosive containers in here. Free stuff. Oh, there's a button. And pick up stuff first. Yeah, flares. Oh, 
Oh, that was... Not my pistol. I haven't made that mistake before. Alright, flashbangs are nice. Whoopsie. Oh, I fucking knew there'd be dudes. I knew it. Oh, is it one dude? You got more dudes? I run over dudes. I even look in that. Oh, do you mind not hitting me? Oh, what's going on in here? Nothing. Dodge. I nice dodge. Let's get in this car. Just get out of here. The coffee, but the coffee, the useless coffee. Right. Hey, do you mind being chill for a second, guy? All right. Don't seem to have done a great job here. Uh, okay. Anyway. Well, I think I'm supposed to be driving right now. Don't mind that. That's just a thing. Still not sure if it's like a hallucination or a bug. Just kind of fun. I hear sirens. Pharaoh, where are you? Hmm. I'm sure nothing will happen in this giant place. That doesn't look like it'll get possessed. Are you my friend? Can I have you? Right. This thing is my friend. I think I see a button. The flashbang, some flares. Press that button. Oh no! Who should have predicted? Anyway, press the button. You good? He's good. Okay. Uh, what did that button do? Oh shit! What up, dude? Oh, I got players! Out. I don't know what that button did. Oh, I think I moved something over here. Cool. Oh, I lifted that. I. Or it would be a shame if something possessed it and dropped it on my head. Oh, we're good. Okay. It's car time. It's always car time. Welcome to Alan Drives. I think I can. Do oh shit! Make that jump. We're fine. Everything's fine.
This log is. Yay! When I told Barry my plan back in the well lit room, I'd acted as if I knew what I was doing. I didn't. I was operating on the shifting logic of a dream. I had to fight my way to the lake through the horrors of the night. I had to flick an old battered light switch imbued with childhood magic. I had to write a happy ending to a horror story. I had to save my wife from the dark prison she was being held what? in. <clears throat> Alright, Alan. Guess I'm trapped. And then Alan starved to death. Just what am I supposed to do, bro? Oh. Parkour? Parkour? Help! Oh. oh, computer! I'm trapped! Here, hold on. Can I push? I can push. Alan needs a personal trainer. I will never give her to you. Oh no. Uh, what am I focusing on exactly? Oh, the giant death tornado over guys. Armors are the opposite of hunter goggles. I mean, okay. Okay, I get the feeling I have to take this fight. Oh, that didn't even kill a dude! That didn't even kill one dude! Game? What? How dare you? Happy ending to a horror story. You're gonna put I me back here? My wife Who? Prison she was being held in. You're gonna make me seriously? Who put this autosave in? Airless. Careless autosave. I mean, compared to all the other ones. I will never give her to you. Okay. Yeah, I kind of like to be able to run. Thanks. You throw that shit at me. No, don't you do it. Oh, he did it. Alan dodge. Alan get ripped. Alan flush. And Alan die. Alan die. Dudes, and you're gonna put me all the way back. Oh, trash game. Happy ending to a horror story. What an awful fucking save. From the dark prison she was being held in. All right, game hard. It's probably not enough. And it's there's like eleven cutscenes. I will never give her to you. Pull out my fucking eardrums every time. So I can't run.
Does that just not affect you? Why is two flashbangs not enough to kill a single dude? He has full health too! Why? Pushing. Okay, don't fire a flare. <sighs> this place doesn't seem very helpful. Alan Bush. One dude. Just I one see dude. Mirror peak in the distance. That's where Cauldron Lake was. Okay. Or is a shame we can't just take the fucking helicopter. All oh, right, they crashed the helicopter. We're good. Okay. Right. Everything will be fine. This is safe. Everything's fine. Just stand up on two legs. Oh, I see birds. Find birds. Got more birds. Oh, guess I'm dead. Really? Oh, okay, cool. Well, that was easy. This looks safe. No. Nope. I see cash. Do you have stuff? Flashbangs, flares, yeah. Uh, I will switch out for the shotgun because I just don't have very many bullets for the hunting rifle, even though it's much better than the shotgun. I have to go to Cauldron Lake. I think I'm gonna have to fight birds. We still have the OP flashlight. Oh no. These birds didn't give a shit about the over around here. Ah. 
Oh, you know what? I probably should have gone that way. Burns down. Oh no. Ow. Really already? Christ. Oh, there's goo. I like goo. Oh, you got birds. Birds and goo. Nope. Did you? Okay, that way. Mm, it doesn't look like it. Have too many flares? Alright, I can just start like shocking flares. Okay. I'm made of flares. Alan Flare. Yeah, why not? Oh, hello. Hello. We're gonna be for you for most of the time. I have so many flares. Oh no. Man, if that thing ever learns how to aim. Quickly, drop a flare. Where'd it go? Oh, where the ah. fuck did that come from? Ow. Right. Three dudes. He's gonna hit me. I don't like this enemy type. This is like a waste of fucking time for like a year. It's super annoying. Okay.
easy. Okay. Still have a bunch of flares. I got this. Oh. I did. Calculated. Ow, why? I didn't touch shit! Game was like, fuck you. It was too smooth. Ow, fuck. Goddamn goo. Ow, fuck. Goddamn goo. I see yellow. The darkness wears her face. Okay. Pretty sure I've seen that one before. I got lots of flares. Darkness controls the Taken. Yeah. Oh, rare invisible wall in this game. Weird. Ah, uh, okay. I'm clearly missing a beat. How do I get out of here? Yep. I'm trapped. I mean, I guess this will take me where I need to go. Or also be an invisible wall. What the fuck? Could I have jumped on that side, I guess? On on the left side? Am I blind? Again, I hate how the level geometry is always like super open, like loose boards and stuff. It's very non-diegetic. Oh, yeah, okay. Maybe this way is the way to go, huh? It would be a shame if I was ambushed. Electricity. It's my friend. Yay! Sorry. Yay! Woo! Ah! This is Alan's favorite thing. Like, write it. I needed to get the generator running. Needed to get the generator running, okay. Does this help? Hold on, maybe if I get enough electricity in me, I can start the generator by touching it. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, alright. All right. How do I get the generator running? What's going on over here? Useless coffee. The best. I see a door. Do you have a generator? No. Generator. Got one of those generators. Oh, I see a green thing. Way over there. How? It's so far away. OP. I wonder if things are going to attack me.
Why was that so long in slow mo? Come at me, bros. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Just a little bit. He's... He's not a very efficient flashbang. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Sure do hope I don't get attacked while this very slow elevator crushes me. Do you die? Well played. Oh, great. Autosave. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, damn it. Alright. Be funny if that squished me as well. Okay. Thanks, light bulb. No, 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 no. Why would you do this? Oh my God. Jesus fucking Christ. Okay. Why is that an option? Slowest elevator in the goddamn universe. All right, now pick up a manuscript page and some stuff. Stuff, 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 stuff. I love stuff. I got flares. Okay. Yep. Okay. Turn him back. GG. You win. Bye. Alan's going home. The freedom! Why did they suddenly invent invisible walls? Eh. Bye. Ah, fuck, I didn't see that one. Come at me, poltergeist. I can parkour all of your amateur shit. It's too easy for Alan to die suddenly. Okay, cool. I guess all that stuff was haunted? Why here? But why the- okay. Okay. Alright. I see how it is. Scroll. Scroll developers. Freedom. All right, and may I never ride that elevator ever again. You got dudes? Turn back now. Turn back this time. Dude, I hate that cut it keeps doing for like a nanosecond. It was so fucking loud. Stabbing me. It's flare time. I think there's another guy here. Hello. I shoot you. Again. Die, car. Die, boat. There. 
Got more dudes? Oh, it's got a barrel. Ow. It hurts. Die barrel. Die boat. Die boat. Spindle. Oh shit. Bro, this boat is OP. Blair. Fucking hell, man. Oh, they just... Okay. Wow. Do as you're told. Do as you're told. How about I don't and we say I did anyway? Ah! Ow. Go away, go stop. Okay, yeah, I love that eardrum splitting cutscene. It was like the 19th one. I like this rock though. Oh, fly rock. I got to fight this tornado. Oh, you missed. Oh, destroy the tornado. I'm fighting a tornado. Alan does not fear near objects. Does Alan look like he's scared? Oh, yeah, he's a little scared right now. Alan, come on, man. You're not scared. Now's not the time for fear. It's time for jumps. Alan Parkour. You will fail. Where? I don't know if that helps. Uh, what am I fighting right now? You're making this up. No, you're making this up. No! Why would you drop the flare gun? Alright. <gasps> and Alan Dive lines up. Or, and he belly flops and dies at the end. Hell. Two out of ten. Dive. Oh no, I'm waking up for the 27th time in a location where Shh, different baby, stuff. You were having a bad dream. I think this is evil it Alice. It's just another nightmare. No. Everything's fine. You're home. No, evil it Alice. Wasn't dream. It wasn't a dream. Everything's fine. Turn the lights on. Turn the lights on! That's not Alice, bro. Shh, baby. The power's out. There's no light. Come back to bed and I'll make you forget all about your fear in the dark. Okay. My fear? It's your fear. Why aren't you afraid? You're not Alice. Turn the lights on now. Who's Where's Alice? The what did you do with it? Where's the clicker? Alan, honey, you're still one foot in a dream. 
You're not making any sense. Come back to bed. Okay. Oh, I gotta find the clicker. You sure? Or I can't just... No. Nope. Guess the bathroom's locked. Hmm. Oh. He can teleport. That's normal. Go on to grab your sunglasses, take your pills. No. Alright. Hello, evil teleporting shadow Alice. Alan, How are things? You're scaring me now. Bye. Come back to bed. Have you taken your pills? Do you want me to call Dr. Hartman? I read your manuscript. It's brilliant. Departure is your best work yet. You're a genius. I'm so proud of you. Come back to bed. Uh, oh. mm, keys? No. Is it in here? No. Is it out here? Nope. Is it in here? Maybe. Oh, she teleported again. Well, that time maybe Come she didn't. Look her. Come back to bed, Tom. I got a flashlight. I choose her. Ah ha ha! All right. Secretly, I wanted to kill Alice the entire time. No, um, I assume that wasn't Alice, or Alice isn't real, or I'm not real. It could go a lot of directions at this point. Is Zane real? The real one? I hit the clicker, and a big daddy from Bioshock showed up. You must find your way to the cabin. It stands in your way. It won't let you pass. It has no heart. It's filled with darkness. You must fill its heart with light. Why is that dude just smiling? Don't mind him. He's Mr. Sh your friends will meet him when you're gone. What does that mean? Okay. Use the clicker. Maybe don't. Maybe don't use the clicker. Shopping cart, path, phone, barrel. Nope, I want a thermos. Ow. I want a bird. Ow. I'd like a barrel. Ow. Interesting. Oh, I'm like writing right now. I want free shit. All right, fine. Give me a path. This is cool. I'm leaving you. What? I'm leaving you, Alan. I met someone. I'm in love with someone else. Alice? No, what do you say? You can't. You don't love me. How could you? You don't even love yourself. All you do is torture yourself with work you can't do anymore. No, I, I love you more than anything in the world. You're... You're my muse! I'm not. Bird. Who are you? What have you done with my Alice? Alice? What are you doing? Put the light back on! What are you doing, Alan? Stop! Put the light back on! It wasn't true. Nothing like that had ever happened. You're not my Barbara! Tom, I promised to be good. Please, I'm tiny, you naughty boy. I will help you write your masterpiece. I will love you for that. No, you're not Barbara Jagger. I made a terrible mistake. I should have never written you back. You came back wrong. Your heart is filled with darkness. Put that knife away, Thomas. Put it down. My heart is filled with darkness. Cut it out. Ah! Ah! I'll take you back to the depths you came from. I'm not 
100% picking up Get away all of from this. Me, Tag. Bird, Where am I? Let me go. Alice, Alice, I'm coming. We need more birds. Your husband refused to do as he was told. All he had to do was write what I wanted him to write. Now it's too late. It's his fault. You'll stay here forever. Oh no. The end. I think my flashlight is invisible. Now you will never get her back. I am much older than you. Do you like flash bang grenades? Older than your first work of art. I will find a new face to wear. Uh, someone else to dream me free. Shadow Demon down. I could feel Alice's presence close by. I understood what I had to do now. I knew how to write the ending to departure. There's light and there's darkness. Cause and effect. There's guilt and there's atonement. But the scales always need to balance. Everything has a price. That's where Zane had gone wrong. There's a long journey through the night back into the light. No. Oh no! And this time he doesn't die doing a belly flop and then finds her. Or doesn't. Mild seizure warning. Stop hitting the clicker, Alan. Now Alan is gone. Presumably. Alan! So what, she fell off a cabin and then just comes back up and then Alan is missing? That's like her experience of things.
Bruh, deer fests, for sure. Yeah, deer fests. Sure, those guys murdered a, a nurse or orderly or something. Why do you have that lantern, Rose? I uh, hear typing. And then Alan won the lottery. The end. It's an ocean. What? Oh, is that like literally the end? That was a pretty tough game, to be honest. Although, again, the, the autosaves were extremely um, generous, so you, you pretty much got to repeat the fights over and over again. It wasn't too bad. Yeah, I'm sure they have this license Ground properly. And nerds. Take your protein pills and put your helmet on. Ground control to major tones. Seven. Hmm. So they're making a sequel. That's interesting. Kind of American psycho. Like, how many people did I kill? No people? Many people? Um... We'll see if there's something extra at the end. Um, maybe a bit more enemy variety. You never really like had to fight like dudes and birds at the same time, right? That would have been kind of cool. Um, weird difficulty curve for sure. Quite pretty game. I mean, this is the remastered version, but uh, actually, yeah, pretty pretty. They're making a sequel soon after they uh, did Control. Seems like it could be good. I'll say Control is a much better game than this. Much better. This game is hilarious, though, actually. I had quite a bit of fun playing it. Stories all over the place. I don't know. Interesting, though. Kind of confused if like the demon had to do with the town or because it was it seems to kind of indicate that it was sort of a town problem 
Like, I don't think Alan, like, created the town from the ground up, right? Um. Also, Barry, right? Barry just got the fucking slip out, like, no problem. Um. There's gotta be a sequel so Barry can die. I'm like... Probably joking? I'm probably joking. I never did find Cheryl, my daughter. Wrong game. Whoops. Um... I don't know if the remaster actually, like, brought any other gameplay stuff, or if it was just straight up. Generally, when it says remaster, it's just the... Just, like, the textures and graphics and stuff. Nothing, uh... Too much gameplay-wise. But you never know. But yeah, I suspect, uh... Alan Wake 2 will be pretty, uh, pretty cool game. There's a lot of, like, a lot of mechanics that you can do with it, the light and the dark and what have you. Um, and just having, like, a protagonist that's, like, writing their own story. You know what I mean? There's a lot they can do, for sure. Because, yeah, they improved a lot for control. Eternal credits. So did Barry have free will? Oh yeah, did some of those characters exist? Or did he like straight up create a few of those people? Because it did seem like he straight up created a few of those people too. Again, I don't know. It's... Fairly ambiguous. Although, I didn't really read any of the papers that probably clear up a lot. I think you were, yeah, you are supposed to, like, pick them up and then listen to them, like, as you got them. I did not... ...figure that out, um... ...until... ...pretty far in. But it's unclear if it would have actually, well, cleared anything up. Jeez, if I knew it was going to be like 20 minute credits. See, I have no idea how this game did. Um, like commercially. I mean, well enough that they survived. To make control and I guess now Alan Wake 2. Too well now. Wait, who's Alice Wake? Oh, never mind. I'm dumb. Uh, I was <laughs> actually thinking Cheryl for a second. So what was with Nightingale? He was like... 
there for two seconds and then a tornado i was expecting him to come back as like a demon or something not like a demon but like an enemy or whatever he really does just get ripped out by a tornado and just that's that's it and i guess you find some flashbangs in his room They ran out of music for the credits. Okay. Yeah, Poe! Damn it. Why did we never get a third album? Damn you, Sony music? Sony music? I don't know. Somebody screwed her over. Tis, tis a shame. Books written by Alan Wake. Alan Wake's journey through the night will continue. I wonder if that was in, like, the original. I mean, I guess they probably always intended to make a sequel. I really don't know. Oh, seriously? Nothing? 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 Nothing?